What up, everybody? Whoop whoop. This is Xavier Penguin, ready for another Let's Play of Archibald's Adventures. And let's go ahead and get started here today. Playing on my new Asus laptop I got. Uh, what is it? The N56V series. So hopefully a lot of this will run a lot better, smoother, and all that good jazz. So we are on World 3. Let's go ahead and get started. Alright. Keyboard layout's just a little bit different. Maintenance pods are stored in the upper storage area. Get one to continue the game. Alright. Oh, okay, cool. We've got the lasers of destruction. Woo! Yes, let's go down. Now where is that going to take me? Eh! Stop it! I am trying to do something. There we go. I need to see where that. Oh, that's going to take me over there. Okay. Oh, I got. Oh, I got to do that anyway. Mother. There we go. And. Alright, now I've got to get across here. How in the. Hmm. I has an idea. Alright, we got that. Ah, dang it. Well, that was the first death of today. I can't do anything with it. Ah, dang it. Hmm. Get over, get over. Alright, so. I think I'm gonna make this easier for myself. There we go. In case I have to cross back over. Uh, no. It goes down there, so. I need to move this block over here. Oh, plus buckets anonymous. Oh wait, this can work. This can work. Hmm. Well, hmm. I've got to restart. Let's go back to the beginning again. Yeah, I knew that that would happen. Oh, so close. So close. Ah, you punk. There we go. Dang it. 
Dang it, I hate, I hate it. There we go. Now I think I have got to get this box. Come on. There we go. Alright, if I didn't do that, I'd have to restart the level over again. Let me try it. Yes. Yes, thank you. Thank y'all. Yay! Balls of goodness! there wasn't an actual like outright you know, gate to go in number two you enter the service pod and turn the systems on an old man's face appears on a small screen on the console boy now you are in a maintenance pod well it can't do any tricks right now but it soon will believe me the pod rolls around and behaves the same right the same way you ride a skateboard Moving, jumping, fawning, etc. Everything stays the same. Be careful, though. You are also still vulnerable to creatures and traps in the same way. To gain new features, you must roll to the chamber to the right and install a magnetic system into your pod. Go on, boy. Alright, come on, move, little blob dude. There is an operating magnet for the pod on the nearby pedestal. Using magnetism, the pod can stick to the metal walls or pipes and ride up walls or even along the ceiling. Do, 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 do. And you have to press the up button in order to do it. The pod has an operating telescope which you can pull out. With the magnet on the end, you are able to pull yourself up to an otherwise unreachable ceiling. Of course, the ceiling must be made of metal. Click above the pod or press the up arrow or W to use the telescope. What did I say? What did I say? You can unstick from the ceiling if you leave the metal part or if you click below the pod or by pressing S or the down arrow. Trip. Thank you. When stuck to a wall, you can still use the bubble. Press space or enter, or click the pod. Oh, that is good to know. Yay! Bubble goodness! Number three. When falling next to a metal wall, you will stick to it automatically. You can unstick from a wall just like from a ceiling. Try to move away from the wall using your keys or clicking in the desired direction. Oh, I exploded. Do, do, do. Sticking to a wall when falling beside it has another great advantage. It doesn't matter how far you fall, you can use this to survive very long drops. As I crash all the way down. Alright, ah, dang it. I'll hopefully come Friday whenever uh, I get to be paid. We are going to have a lot to donate to charity. Okay, what in the world? I am going to get this. Okay, I know people are going to look at me like, what in the heck are you doing, penguin? What? Ah, dang it. Dang it, penguin, what are you doing? You're messing up. Is 
Is there... I don't know. Oh, there is metal above me. <laughs> what in the world? When unsticking from a wall by moving away from it, the pod will get some initial energy. And thanks to that, you can jump from the opposite wall. Dang it. I didn't go fast enough. Hmm. The telescope with the magnet has limited reach, so sometimes you need to stand on something to reach high enough. Yep, so I've got to get the bubble back. Or the box back. While stuck to a metal floor, you can't jump. Now this complicates the task of making your way across that acid pool. But you can climb down along the wall and jump from there to the opposite wall. And don't forget to open the door first. Yay! Gonna be difficult later! Number four. Uh, stop it! Oh, dang it. Dang it, Pinkland, what are you doing here? Better save that right now before anything else happens. Ah! Thought I could make it. Yay! Ah! Darn it. Yay, bouncy goodness! Hmm. Let's go ahead and keep doing the other four, and let's go in from there on level five. You know, I'm going to... Alright, I'm going to do this. There we go. I'm not going down there pressing all those Goram buttons. Yay! Button pushing! Forget that noise. Your pod can break open crates and crash through weak walls from the side. All you need is enough space to reach the higher speed. When moving at high speed, you will break right through. You can't break the yellow crates, which are hardened though. That is good to know. Ah, I see what we need to do. Alright. You know what? I'm going to make that half. And make this one half as well. You aren't only able to break things from the side, you can do it by moving downwards too. 
Click under the pot or press the down arrow or S when staying on a cracked wall or wooden crate. Yeah. I'm gonna save it right here. Yeah, let's take her all the way across to here. Dang it! Doo -doo. Yes. Ah, oh, poop on a stick. Oh, jeez. Yay! Complete avoidance. Number seven. I'm not going to break you. Gotta turn off my little heater. Yeah, I'm in the basement at the moment. Oh, dang it. Didn't know I could do that. Well, you know what? Fine. Forget you. I'm staying right here. Jeez! Grr! Anger! Alright, so there's not that much room. Do that. Again, I'm just guessing here, y'all. So I apologize for my silence. can drop it from here and knock one of those bad boys down. I bet I can lower this little goomer. Somehow, hmm. 
Well, we're gonna try something stupid again. There we go. And I just gotta remember I can't break any of these little bad boys. I'm going to try that method again. Wait, why do I need to do that? I'm freaking metallic. I can go up walls, punks. Yeah, metal man. All right, so this is the last one for this particular episode. Let us continue to number eight. Hmm. So I need to get rid of the one on the left first. Come on. And then I need to do this one to drop a block. Yes. Now I need to go get said block. Put it right there so I can climb up. And put it about halfway. Yes, yes. Yes! Level finally completed! Alright, y'all. Well, that is my let's play of, and, uh, and yet it moves. Great game, by the way, but that's not the game I'm playing. Uh, Archibald's Adventures. Uh, let's go ahead and head back to the main menu, and by, uh, as always, help me help the children out. You know, help me donate to Let's Play by giving to Child's Play Charity. You can go to my website. It'll be listed right here, lp.disturbed-penguin.net. You probably won't see it because my mouse cursor will be underneath the uh, floating text. Uh, head on over there. Go ahead and uh, help me donate. Uh, if you like what I do, like, love, hate it, comment on it, I don't care. I'm having fun and donating to charity. And again, I encourage you to do as well. Again, my name is Xavier Penguin. I will catch you all on the flip side.